Hello, everyone. RPG Kim Kitty are back with some more. It's Blade Chronicles 3. In the previous video, we made our way into the Makana Woodlands. And then we ran into it on Colony where we met Juniper. It's a fun ass. Uh... Oh, I like I her character. I that sucks that I was like, oh, yeah, I got her character now. I'm not. I got a class and everything. I'm not even using the person who can use this class because. Yeah. Where would you even find 50 glare abunijinis? It's always tough this time of year. Oh, well, what can you do? Wait, do you have more? Hey there, have you been making the most of the rope slides? Yeah, they've made getting around the force a real breeze, thanks. Well, here's a tip then. There's plenty more to be found strong around all over the world. You'll find them useful, that's a guarantee. Whatever you do, be grateful to Juniper for teaching you this life-changing skill. I see, I see. Oh, it's such an enormous relief not to have to fight anymore. I never really liked fighting to tell you the truth. Juniper made exactly the right call as far as I'm concerned. Our flame clock was burning out. Thought that was going to be the end of us. Oh, wow, they all have stuff. Have you seen Rain? He's still not recovered from his injury, so it's a bit worrying if he's gone wandering. That should be enough data. Looks like a bunch of our folks will be heading out to the other colonies that you've liberated. It's like Juniper says, we should look forward to getting out there and seeing new things. Is that what you're going to do? Get out in the world? No, if I left, there'd be no one here to take care of the wounded. It's almost harvest time. Everyone loves the Harvest Festival, but Sparks does cost and really make you work for it. All the troops at Colony Tower make good use of the rope slides. It's worth getting, getting used to the idea that you can make a handy jet any anywhere from Tower as long as you have rope. Handy, I'll say. It's a bit of getting used to, but I'm sure you lot will take it in your stride. Interesting. It's also like a. I'm getting peckish. Do we have any snacks? <sighs> All right, enemy drop boost. Nothing wrong Thanks with that. The food. Oh, look at how cute she is. Juniper's cute. Oh, I needed that. Well dressed, Machina. I look forward to tasting it. I've got a lot to discuss here, and probably some of these are going to be quests. Three of them are okay. Shall we put our heads together on this? So it's all this time a big deal for your lot. It is, yes. We grow virtually all our food in the colony. We can't sustain ourselves on hunting alone, you know. What's the harvest festival all about then? Nothing special, just a harvest, really. We have a lot of crops to bring in at this time of year. You know, problem is we're a bit short-handed this year. People are braced for hard work. Can we be of any use? It's just harvesting, right? I can do harvesting. Would you? It would delay your journey. <laughs> this is the part where you just thank us generously and move on. Uni's right. Okay then, thank you. I'd be grateful for your help. Alright, let's get harvesting. Everyone will be waiting by the entrance of Colony Cow. Banana! -na. Of course, I need Juniper for all of these discussions. Is Ryan okay? Seems like his injury is still not stopping him di diving headfirst into trouble. He was a sworn friend of my predecessor, and he's a master hunter. I understand your concern, but I believe he can take care of himself. So he's a hunter too, eh? He was my hunting teacher for a while. That said, I will say that he doesn't know when to stop chasing a monster. That's not a good com combination with injury. I know he's a capable guy, but it was over, over exaggerating himself that got him hurt in the first place. In that case, maybe we should go and look for him. If, if it looks like he's being reckless, we'll bring him back. Sound good? Sounds great. Let's do it. Hang on, I'm getting a call from Genmu. Genum. 
Hey, Juniper's with you, right? Listen. Sorry for the short nose, Juniper. But could you come and meet me sharp side? We think we found Ryan. I think we better do as he says. Let's go see Galman quick. Uh oh. Hope he's not fucking dead. Rope Everyone, slides. A moment of your time? Hey, I think we're getting pretty good at using these rope slides. Yeah, I Yeah, I feel quite used to them now. And they're a lot of fun too. I feel like I've seen them around the Forneus region as well. I think that makes traversal easier as a welcome to us, as far as I'm concerned. Since we're on the subject, what about those rope launcher gizmos the military has left all over the shop? Oh, those. They're typically carried in and placed by the Elevenus. I'm afraid most aren't in active use. Alright, but if we use them, we might be able to get access to some new places, right? Huh? That's actually a pretty good idea if you... If you ignore the guy that said it. You didn't need to say that last part. Good thinking, Mons. Next time we see one, we'll try using it. And food for Tau. Everyone calling Tau is out gathering food, right? Right. Food stocks are pretty tight in this time of year. It's so really that rough. Could have fooled me. We're not exactly destitute. It's more about our relationship with our neighbors. What do you mean by that? We always give a bit to the Turkins around this time of year. It keeps things sweet between us. We've got something of an alliance going on. That's different. There's yes, this one Turkin. They call the Turkin. Would you like to go and meet him? Sounds fun. I'm game. First, I have to talk to Roland and about the food situation, though. Ba -na -na -na. Interesting stuff we have here. Okay. Let's on a tight loop. As a colony, we're mostly self-sufficient, so we need a heritable land. Enabling you to grow your own food without having to forge. Good thinking. Juniper! Oh, you brought friends. We've come to help with the harvest. Do you need a hand with anything? Oh, are you serious? Yeah, sure, there's plenty of work going around. Glory, don't jest. I had to accept the Turkins' help right now, so they're in. Carson and Glory are in charge of his side. I end the work in the fields. It's better for me to be nearby given the injuries coming in. Injuries? What if farming could be so dangerous? Don't be dense. There's always danger in the forest. So about still willing. Of course. Just tell us what you need from us. In that case, how do you feel about digging up potatoes? Spud Patrol. Got it. Thanks. Shouldn't take long if you all pitch in. Let's dig up some spongy spuds. I believe how many there are. That should be of us. It's quite a few, huh? I bet you they say something different depending on who I'm playing as. More for the harvest. We have to dig here then. Right. Perfect. Let's report back to Carson. Alright, we're done with the harvest. Uh, what's going on? You want to elaborate for us, love? The monsters that have their greedy eyes on our spuds, they're coming this way. This happens every single time. The amount of collateral damage they've caused, I swear. I did wonder what harvesting methods you were using to cause so many casualties. This makes more sense. We'd usually master the whole colony to drive them off. This is your short of people, so... Uh, what do we do? Remember what Uni said. Just thank us generously. No need to stand on ceremony. Uh, oh, right. Yes, yeah, sure. And you'll be that too, Jennifer, of course. Now let's clear those monsters out. Sounds like a plan. 
All righty, let's kill them. I'm the one you want. I'm the one you want. Oh my fucking god. Okay, I think I understood the... Well... Okay, I think I, I'm so much trying to understand the, uh... to the max we took care of the monsters in the vicinity glad to hear it we won't have to been managed that it's so elaborately on our own we can't just let them make off with our treasured taters now can we got that right we put our blood sweat and tears into growing those little spuds Glory and the others aren't technically in charge of the fields, but they help out. When I see them all working so hard, I, the thought of those monsters stealing our hard-earned crops makes me fume. But no one likes being robbed. There's no need to stress over it. If you overthink everything like Carson here, any loss will be a big shock. Hey, come on now! Anyway, the monsters are out of the picture. As far as I'm concerned, that's a win. You're right! Roland will be pleased to, s to stock up on more monster meat, too! Such a greedy guts. I'd rather we sharpen his sense of danger a bit more. If he wants to eat, he has to work hard. But isn't that the exact opposite of... Yes? Uh, never mind. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much for your help. Way to change the subject. Leave it. You harvested the potatoes and there's no harm done. That's the important thing here. True that. All that's left is to eat the fruits or veg of our labors. I'll let you know when the grub's up. That wasn't so bad. We have another thing to talk about, too. Uh, I'll be honest, I, it is very tempting to... My stomach's... Can we get a bite to eat, please? Can't just leave them there. Maybe I should go with Garnazinia. Horrible that our officer has had to die in such a place. Oh no! Can't underestimate a bit of good intel. Thought it occurred to me when I went to check on the fields. Oh yeah. What are the harvesters like in other colonies? There must be plenty of big plots out there. Yeah, your average colony doesn't actually have any fields. They don't? 
forgot to talk to him again once we picked up this thing. They're looking to get to Kevin's castle. You need to go back from the top of tower to the place where we fought. There's a rope slide there you can use, make use of to get on your way. Careful you don't descend too far though. The monsters down there are formidable. Hey, Glory. Thanks for your help out with the harvest. You don't know just how much you've helped. Oh, it was nothing. Just as long as you give us our grubs worth. I'll count on it. It'll be a veritable vegetable feast. Alrighty, so let's go do whatever quest this one is. Which I believe it's this one. Oh, we probably got more people to. Yep. We got it all as requested. It's very tempted to do this. Uh, I don't. I just don't know how many goods I have left. I think I have 15, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's very tempted to do that for. Fuck it. I'm going to do it for her. Ah, I only have three left now. Mmm, okay. I only have three left. I only have a quest when I don't. Oh, I guess the harvest. Well then, how are the food supplies looking? It's all there, I'll run it over. No, we're not done yet. The truth is, we just don't have enough. I don't think the colony's really in a position to be sharing right now. I see. Honestly though, I'm more upset about the prospect of losing my grub to those feather brains. <laughs> oh, that's such a long-standing tradition. I guess we have got to keep it up. I'd rather avoid forcing people to hand food over, if it's at all possible. Will that be okay? We've kept this up because it was a tradition, but if it's giving the colony a hard time, we might have to end it. I'm fine either way. Your decision, Juniper. If you want to keep this token alliance up, then we'll need a hand raising the supplies. I'm looking for green nectarines, turgen greens, shiny roses, and glare arbonages. Fifty of each, if you please. They like it fresh too, so keep their keep their perishables in perishability in mind when you decide what to forge first. If you want to end the alliance, you'd better go and talk with the tokens directly. Makes sense. I'll give it some thought. As I said, it's your decision. I've got some food stock in here. Remember, so don't hesitate to give me a shout. All right. Now to gather the offerings. The colony holds some deeply alien customs. Ah, so I have to like go around and gather them all from other places and stuff like that. My stomach's growling. Hmm, interesting. It's in a decline now, but this place still remains an important strategic point for Agnes. Strategic? Could you elaborate? It can be used as a point of ambush when Kevin's castle or one of the colonies launched an attack for one. I last learned defense. Not tracks. Given this vast expanse of force. But anyway, it's a moot point. There's been no conflict or flare-ups for quite some time now.
If I'm going to be honest, I think I'd ra much rather try to keep the thing going. I know that's probably not a bad idea, but I think that's why I want to keep it going for now. I didn't even notice like this. Oh, is this how we get to... There's something there. This way, please. It'll be faster if we climb up this way. Pure gemstone. This is something decent. Elevator. Oh, is this technically what I'm supposed to go for in terms of quest, probably? Ching. I'm curious to see where that elevator takes us, though. It's another thing to see it for yourself, eh? Doesn't seem to be working. Okay, then. So we got another quest. What up? Juniper, you made it. You said you found rain? Look. A beacon stone. Wait, but that's... Juniper, what's that smoke? It's a beacon stone. We use them when we can't get normal communication out. They really smoke to warn of danger. Wait, so do you think... Looks like your man's in trouble. Ugh, rain. Should go hunting to replenish our luck last of food supplies. Okay, I'll follow the beacon stone. Damn, you ain't here. But you still haven't fully recovered yourself, have you? I'm not risking you too. Understood. Just in case, tell Glory to come after us. We'll be there too, don't you worry. Thanks. Okay, let's make a move. We only use beacon stones for emergencies. I hope nothing bad's happened. I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's go check. Alrighty. This will be interesting. Take 
Let's just sneak a peek. There's definitely a lot of places we need to go to get more stuff like this. Something so valuable here. All right. See how we can get over there. Ah, okay. Is this like a rare thing? I might just go around with the uh, green nectarine one. This might be one that I just go around and do on my own. I know. I think we could slide down that thing. Ah, so if I okay, yeah, that would that one would have just taken us down to exactly where we were. If there's a way for me. Get up there, but nope, okay. I, I think we could slide down that thing. Yes, I know we can. Well, sh shit. back here. Damn it. I was not expecting that. You gotta be very careful on those, huh? Kinda wish there was like a button, like all you gotta do is like, oh yeah, hit it, hit like A or something, so then you can like, well hit A when you get to a certain height of it. Take this down. How oh, the ladder is like. There's not even like a ladder for that. Technically. Let me check. 
It appears we can pass through here. I love that I'm like hidden. Oh, Juniper. Mia, would you do the honors? Nice. Oh, that's the one that we came on. Okay, I was like, how the fuck? I thought there was... I thought... Oh, that was close. Okay, I guess we don't get there from here. If I have to go here to go to where I need to go for this dude. My mistake. See once I kill, keep going like around this way or something. So far from my colony before. You'll do just fine, Juniper. Let's go. Could that be a path? Ugh, it just spat something out. Bleh. Not be all good. Don't attack me, please don't attack me. I don't like our Oh task. god, it's attacking me. I can keep them occupied. I should have done more. Fuck! Okay, we won't go that way for a bit. Stuff that I've already picked up, it's that's like stuff I'm gonna pick up like that's for me to pick up on my own time. We'll take this down. We'll take this down. It'd be hilarious if I could swap while I'm in the middle of that. Is there oh, a good use for that? Go on from here. <sighs> hmm. 
This was a nice find. Oh, I thought that was like... Oh, they're just gargles. Oh, sweet, sorry. What the snuff? Where'd this come from? Careful, here it comes. It's a Kavetsi. A mere illusion. I'm the one you want. This will keep me going. It disappeared. Uh, what just happened? It's likely we're being pursued, but I've never seen a loveness like that before. Could it be a new model? Don't think we'll get very far it's just theorizing about. It. Let's hurry on ahead. Fair enough. But we should stay on our toes until we've reached the woodland at least. Okay, that just became a quest. That was literally. I feel like did that need to be a quest? <laughs> did that really Our need to be a quest? Pan and into the fire. Sweet. Let's the 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 fully mobilized. So let's pick them off one at a time. Got a rare dude all right here. Got a well dude all right here. God, I'm finding like those glare things. And the turkey grass isn't that hard either. It's, it's literally just that lime thing that they need. Rain. Does that remember anyone else of, um, remind anyone else of in Final Fantasy X at the wedding scene when they're sliding on down? Right, are you alright? You guys, how did you? He's on your beacon stone, but your hut. It's pretty bad, but he'll be fine. I've got this. Who's in my. Edge. I'll frustrate myself if I could outdo you, Juniper. Stop talking. These wounds won't close up unless you hold still. Sorry. Looks like the hunter got himself hunted. That quarry. That monster. It was a strange one. Felt off. Dangerous. I understand, Rain. You will rest now. That's an order. I can only argue back in this sorry strait. I'll be good. Let's go monster hunting. Trademarked by Capcom, New USA, and Japan. Now the green nectarines. That's... Oh my lord. Oh no. 
You know what would be hilarious if this ends up being the Territorial Rampart or the um, Immovable Gonzalez? Story again. Everyone is emergency. What's up, Manana? Manana cannot. Manana cannot go on like this one extra step. We have been walking since calling Tao, I suppose. If we can find a good place, we'll set up camp, okay? Meh, Ben need more dinner. You can be strong a little longer, can't you, huh? Just a little? Fine. But Manana very, very starving today. We need to make dinner soon, and everyone must help cook. Sure, we'll all be happy to chip in. Right, guys? I'm curious to see what tactics you have in place surrounded by so much nature. What say we go hunting together? I'm fairly well versed in that. Okay, well, obviously we need to camp there to continue on with the story, but let's do this side quest for now. Ah! Fine, we'll continue on with the story. I've been craving some downtime. Ah, oh, I like this one. Ah. Oh. Why can't the, why won't they let me take a shot of this? Fuck you, game. <sighs> Fuck you, game. I was getting kind of sleepy. I was getting kind of sleepy. Na, na, na. Mm. Na, na. Gosh, food is entirely missing. Manana not even get single fill of stomach yet. I just saw you stuffing your cheeks. The rations should have been divided equally. Manana walked more than you used to today. Tommy was rumbly grumbly. Not much we can do, though. Not now. Manana, look, we've still got a ways to go. So you're going to have to get used to rationing stuff out, okay? I still like Manana. Alright, who's up? Turkins! <laughs> Gasp! All oh, the food's completely gone! Gasp! <gasps> What's up? What's wrong? What did you say was gone? I think she was yelling about food. What? No way! For real! French Shaw did not just put elsewhere and forget. Nuh-uh! I'm positive it was right here. Indeed. I checked it myself before I turned in. Don't tell me someone scoffed the whole lot. Ah, oh, no way. Nah. Nah, nah, we'll leave no plate unpolished. No, let's not turn That's on Manana. Awful. All right, all right, we get it. Just chill out already. Manana refused to become frosty. This now matter of honor and refuse to become frosty. I know Manana was feeling a bit peckish, but she can't have eaten up the lot. So who then? That guy barely eats at all, right? Indeed. Riku practice ancient not on art of restraint. Hey, check it. Manana, do not. A feather. But what kind? I found tracks here. Nobody's blaming you. These footprints. I think they're turkey. 
Mystery solved then. A turk in feather. So they raided our supplies. Lands can stop. Apology. Honor and dignity of Manana left in tatters for a vile and faceless accusation. Come on, please lighten up already. All accusations aside, we're really strapped for food. Guess we'll have to go foraging. I concur. Luckily, this area is pretty bountiful all in all, so we might not be too hard pressed. Well, better get to it. Right. Okay. Anyway, that clearly too much eat. Manana is bottomless pit. Manana? <laughs> well, had Riku know, Manana is dainty eater. Not denying. Lies and deceit. Lies and deceit. Days, Manana will have retribution. On this day of days. <laughs> Like we've got ourselves a runner. Slipped out from the castle. Is this okay? He could get in touch with Ouroboros. Won't that impact our previous arrangements? Not to worry. If he does make contact, they'll come. <laughs> really? Ouroboros are simply like that. Hmm. Well, if you say so. We can probably take your word. Right, O? Mmm, certainly. As you say, P, we probably can take his o word. O-N-P. Ah, O-P. Why are I out here gathering food? We could think about building up a reserve of stuff that will keep for a while. That's a good idea. What'd that be? Mushrooms, nuts, that sort of thing? I'm on it! By the way, when the tokens go into our camp, did no one s seriously notice? Nope, not even slightly. Not even a tiny little bit. Ricky was busy sawing logs all night long. I'm sorry, you guys. We don't walked a lot yesterday. I'm sure you were just super pooped. You never miss something as obvious as turkey footprints on a good day, Mimi. I think it's safe to say we were all possibly guilty of negligence this time. Indeed. However, we should also reconsider our storage arrangements for the future. Ah, oh, well, it's water under the bridge now. No point taking locks after the autumn's already bolted, am I right? Let's just get to the searching already. Very well. Hey, is that? An onlood! Food! It's hard to fill up on mushrooms alone. I say we'll have some meat as well. Woohoo! I love me some hunt hunter gatherings. Seriously? Me is sparking amazing. Sparking amazing. Guess we know what's on the menu today, then. Okay, but can I go this way now, please? Fuck off! Uh, you're not even there. gonna. You're seriously not even gonna let me go to where I would want to go. Look a bit further back. <sighs> Don't get me wrong. I like like <laughs> this game is great, but moments like that where it's like, oh hey. Here's a side quest that you picked up. We won't let you go forward, though. Whoa, visitors. Oh, shit. I can keep them occupied. Come on, you want. I'm the one you want. Good.
Much relief. Glad Riku had just power frame last night. Should perform 30% better than leading brand. The leading brand. What's you on about leading brand? I get that we're weaker than Agniant, so we need this to get on more of an even footing in combat, but... Friends say but. Why but? We just need oomph, you know, like kapow sort of thing. Sound effects not help comprehension. Oh, you know. Like that doodad Noah has. Doodad? Ujima flip. You know what I mean. Don't make me say it. Ujima flip. What friend want to use for? Uh, well, I... Not on your end by any chance. I... If so, Riku have to pass. Oh, come on. So Riku gets right. <sighs> Backing up. This plan of Lance. Noah privy to it? <sighs> Make decision without consult allies? Bad form. Bad form. He's a enemy. And who decide that? You're never say himself? That he enemy? He didn't. I did. In absence of complete picture? Well, but uh, he's different. So after me just once, Lance make up mind? <sighs> then what are we gonna do? Only thing friends can. Keep moving forward. How's that gonna solve anything? Should never have asked. Also, do that, not that kind of thing. Excuse me. <sighs> okay. Maybe once I finish this story, this weird story quest, they'll like let me this. go that way. Once I finish the stolen provision quest. Whoa, check this place out. looking tree Meh. oh wondrous day cannot believe eyes it's fruit of legend bright fig <laughs> bright fig what's a bright fig when it's at home let me guess they're stupidly delish they're stupidly oh, delicious guaranteed. We'll be picking up jaws from ground for weeks. Uh oh. What's up? Are they rotten or something? Tragedy strike. These not ripe for plucking yet, let alone eating. If eat now, bitter flavor cause agonizing death. Huh? I don't know. They look tasty enough to me. Bright fig not good for eating even after full yellow. Still have to wait another year before able to enjoy. Yeesh. That's too long. Man, so much for that. Never mind. You can always come back next year. It's legendary, right? You wouldn't want to miss out. Guess we'll have to. But me, a year from now? Yep. Even if I might not get to do it. Yeah, that's why she said you, you have to. Have taste. Why wouldn't you... Whoa. Love, you've got to stop being so detached about it. You'll just get everyone feeling guilty. Oh, sorry, sorry. Please don't mind me. I actually really like this. The fact that, like, I think everyone but Mio is, like, in the ninth or eighth term. I, I can't rem I know uh, Noah, Lands, and Uni are in their, like, ninth term. Close to get getting to their tenth, I believe. It's so weird that... Um, 
and I have no idea where um, uh, Senna and uh, Tylen are. But I like this that like one, we have one character that's like super close to the end of their final term, just to see like how it's gonna happen. Like what happens at the end of their term? Do they will they just disappear regardless or what? Don't mind me, she says. Of course we're gonna mind you, doll. Doll. Doll love. In it. Hey, how can you be so casual about it? What do you mean, casual? I assure you, I'm not. I'm actually pretty flustered. You defo don't look it. If it looks that way to you, well, that's because I shouldn't even be here. What do you mean? Mm -hmm. This life's a gift from a dear friend. It should have been me. I should have died out there that day. So this isn't really me. I'm just living on her time. Maybe that's why. Hmm. Somehow, that reminds me of us. I know. When we're interlinked, I can see a glimpse. Inferno. Destruction. Land screaming. Noah's memories. What if... Bear with me. That friend of yours, she showed up like Euron. As an enemy? As an enemy. As an enemy. I suppose I'd want to know same as Lance. Simply why. Gotcha. I figured. Mm. Why is it that you gave your life for mine? Why? You could have lived longer yourself, Miabi. Why did you do it? So her name was Miabi. Miabi. Sorry. Guess it's a sensitive subject. Well, she'll be M if that's the case. It's funny. I thought I had it all locked down. Thank you. What was the handkerchief? Whatever a reason, I'd accept it. The facts. Whatever the truth may be. And that's it. No looking back. Well, my de facto partner's running full steam ahead. I mean, I can't very well go backwards, can I now? Your partner's now, eh? <laughs> I suppose you are at that. Hmm? <laughs> I wonder, how does he see things? Oh my god! Right, we'll find some more food over that way. Oh my god, this is just tugging at my heartstrings for many, many reasons, and I fucking love it. God damn it. I'm just waiting for the moment where it's like, hey, here's our journey. Here's our journey, like, you know, we're not quite at the end there, but it's like, oh shit. Uh... Mio's time is up, you know. There's gonna be that moment is gonna come. I don't think that's gonna happen at the end of the game. That's gonna happen fairly close to the end, where it's like Mio's Mio's time's up. 
she has to go now. Bye bye. It's been it's her last three months or however long she has left. Went away. So now uh, she goes bye bye. But then, like, there's a moment where it's like, oh, like her life. I I, I don't know. I, it's like, like, how is that working? Like, I'm still so, so curious as like what happens even if they don't like get sent or whatever. But there's gonna be a moment. We're gonna get hey. that moment. What's this food you're on about? Did you scoff it all up already? We couldn't even if we wanted to. Huh? Is that? Oh. Can't even go anywhere past this. Hmm? What's this? We ate those yesterday, didn't we? Must be lots of them in these woods. Seems so. Well, that explains it. What explains what? At first glance, it looks just like a kelp mushroom, but in fact, it's what's called a natty natty, causing overpowered drowsiness when ingested. Huh? Huh, so you're saying? We ate these, and that's why we all slept clean through the Turk and stealing our food. That's my working hypothesis, anyway. I'll go on one meal and the others. Meh, meh. What's my nana who put in dish? Should have known better. We all pick the ingredients together. So it's not like it's your... It's not you that's at fault. But then my nana blew up on lands and saying many lots of mean things. Very deeply sorry. Hey, it's all in the past. More importantly, all this trudging around forging has given me a wicked appetite. It's gone off now, surely. Let's go back to camp and make it into something edible. Yeah. Manana agree also. I love when Manana does her jump like that. I don't know why it's so fucking cute. Again, this felt like another one of the... Xenoblade Chronicles 1 has that. Xenoblade Chronicles 2 had that. It just feels like fluff. Like, it just feels like this is fluff, uh, uh, padding. Or whatever you want to call it. I thought it more than that. I mean, I, not that it's like a bad thing, but it definitely feels like, yeah, no, this feels like super padding for whatever strange reason, in a way. In a way, it feels that way, but again, I can also see it like, oh, it's not too bad. Huh? Is that... This isn't worth our time. Let's end this quick. No boy. No boy. I'm the one you want. This will keep me going. Come after me, and that's what you get. If only you didn't charge off on your own. Is this like a rare thing? All right, then. That should be us good for food now. Yeah. Looks like that'll last us a little while. <gasps> What's wrong, Mia? <gasps> Who's there? Come out! I knew it. <gasps> it's our... It's, um... Bliaris. Bliaris. Yeah, much better. I owe you. What are you doing over this way? I thought you were going to the castle. Yeah. No, I went. And this is what I got for my trouble. So, tell us, what happened? Oh, 
Oh boy, here we go. We're going to learn what they did. But why, Your Majesty? Why would you attack Colony 4? You came into contact with Ouroboros, did you not? <gasps> I'd call it burning out the contagion. C contagion? You're implying we've been contaminated? Have you not? You've been removed from the protection of the flame clocks. You no longer need to wager your lives in battle. Who struggles not in life deserves not to live. That is the compact of our nation. And moreover, the truth. Fuck you, bitch. Majesty, my queen. Yet, to punish you all for fate's machinations would be a misstep. Therefore, I shall grant you a chance. What must I do? Eliminate Ouroboros. <gasps> you want me to... Noah and the rest? Naturally, I am cognizant of the fact that the enemy is wily and capable. I have no intention of sending you alone. Oh. Uh, Kamaravi. Why, why are you here? Ethel. Uh, how? But you're not even on the same side. Entertainment. Pardon? Those who have been released from the Flame Clock's sacred indenture cannot be affected by the Merbius Iris. To bring you back under control, I would have to force your rebirth. But that wouldn't be nearly as fun. The power you two wield surpasses even some of our consuls. I have great hopes for you. Ethel. Kamaravi. Kamaravi. Okay. But then why were you attacked, Borliaris? They gave Ethel and Kamaravi new Phronesis. They've been made specifically to kill Ouroboros. The tune-up might take a little while, though you don't have much time. The two of them are after your heads. You're sure of this? Really? That's why I came here, to give you warning. They already know your rough position. That's how I found you in the first place. Great. What's this? Plans of the castle. They were tuning up my Pharonis when I happened upon them. They include schematics for the Annihilator. Take them and go back to Colony 4. Commander, you mean? If they can find us wherever we are, I want to at least secure a way for us to put up a fight. Am I wrong? <laughs> but, Mom, we can't very well. Also, about Noah's group. If you happen across them, tell them this. I will use lethal force, yes? What? Furthermore, tell them I wish them all the best of luck. I hope they reach their goal. God damn, man. Wanda? This just keeps proving that Ethel's the fucking best. Like I said, this just keeps proving that Ethel's the goddamn best. Oh, Ethel. 
She sounds serious. And still telling us to just keep going? Oh, well, that's Ethel for you. Hard-headed as they come. Won't she get into trouble because of you slipping out? Hardly. I'm just one missing foot soldier. No one's gonna pay it any mind. Huh? But your wounds earlier. Uh, truth is, air from falling off a cliff on the way here. <laughs> it was dark as snuff. <laughs> Are you tucking my wings? Well, anyhow, it's nothing for you lot to fret over. This is our problem now. You focus on achieving your objective. We appreciate it. Ah, but man, you know, why's the commander got to duke out with you lot, eh? And why was our foe Kamaravi there, the Ashbar? Feels like the whole world's turned on its head. Alrighty, I'm heading back. Got it? You lot scoot on along out of these parts. There's still some time before they're done tweaking. And with you on foot... We're not running away. Not after all this. Huh? I'm staying too. What? Really? That light we saw a while back. If that... If that had come from the Annihilator... Even if we were to somehow reach our destination... If it was at the cost of all your lives... It wouldn't be worth it. <sighs> Surviving like that, I couldn't bear it. Mimi. Mimi. Boliaris, the castle plans. Can you share them? Oh. No, uh, you're not. You wouldn't. Oh, hells yeah. The fact remains, it was us that destroyed your clock. Therefore, yes, but that's. Either way, I think it's clear at least part of the blame lies with us. It's only fair, then, that we destroy this Annihilator. Agreed? You for real? I think it's like chap... So, I here's think... the thing. Twitter was going crazy, like, a couple days after this game first came out, about, like, oh, shit, Chapter 4, oh, shit, Chapter 5. We're in Chapter 4, and I have a feeling we're getting very close to that moment, that oh, shit tour. moment. Same here. He did offer us shelter. That creates an obligation. No way around. Someone here needs to keep friends in line. Count Riku in. If plan on fighting, we'll need first-rate chef too. Oh. And that's it. No looking back. While well, my de facto partner's running full steam ahead. I mean, I can't very well go backwards, can I now? Oh, fine. Go on, then. You wouldn't make it far inside the castle without a proper healer anyway. Without a proper yeah. healer. Thanks, guys. You're, You're the clearly best. not a healer, I don't think. I think she's an... I don't know what she is at, at this moment, if I'm being completely honest. Well, she might be a healer. I'll head back to Colony 4. In case the shit hits the fan. And boy, up, howdy, is it probably going to? Yeah. We'll be all right. I feel like I should go around to, like, go back to Colony 4 to Remember, make sure, because I feel like that's probably going to go up in Get smokes close, afterwards. We may come under fire. What's our plan? I think we'll be able to manage, as long as we're careful. Come to think of it, you used to go to the castle for offseer training once a year, right, no? The Black Fog. Is there much there? There's actually quite a bit. Around this time, the whole area is shrouded in it. They couldn't find us in that cave in Neil Valley, right? And you think we can repeat that? Maybe. Using the fog to approach is clever, but risky. What if an annihilation event occurs? You know... I hadn't really given it much thought up until you mentioned it, but oddly, it hasn't been happening. Seriously? I'm not sure why. 
I feel like those annihilation events are not so random as we think. There's an ether deposit being mined in an area facing a lake. The ether being obtained there is then delivered into the castle through a freight entrance. So that's where we'll get our sneak on. There won't be anyone in the containers. If we can just get to them without being spotted, then we can get into the castle. Okay, let's assume we do give the guards the slip. What do we do once we're inside the place? Tyon, the sensors. What was the Colony 4 soldier's search radius, with the fog out? Their scanning range... I put in the ballpark of 15 metri. Look here. In the reserve area, there's a maintenance hatch that leads directly to the outer wall. If we make it through here and get to the main housing, it'll land us in front of the Annihilator. Less chance of being spotted by troops outside, too. We can do this. There's one concern. The castle is the Queen's residence. What if we're found by the Consuls? Then I guess we'll have a fight on our hands. But it's not like we don't have a retreat. Here. In Keves, after a homecoming, they wash away the belongings of the dead as part of a ritual. It's an understated affair. And the channel they use for it is here. It flows straight out, connecting to the lake outside the castle. I see. So we open a hatch near the Annihilator, ride the current, and we should come out right at the lake. More snuffy in water. Every time we run, why do we always end up getting drenched? I mean, feathers are a bitch to dry. Every time being our grand total of once. Well, let's just hope we don't have to fight. That's the ideal case. That's it, then. Mm. Ready whatever supplies you need. Then we can go. Alrighty. Nice. Alright, guys. That's going to do it for this part of Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Holy crap. I'm... I I'm liking this a lot, if I'm being completely honest. Like, this is re... This is getting really good. Um... Yeah, okay. Uh, okay, we're not half we're almost halfway done to chapter 4, so we'll see. Um I think what I'm going to do, maybe I'll go around I'll probably go around the other colonies quickly between this part and the next part. Uh more so colony 9 or 4. To see if there's anything I need to pick up over there and such. So Oh wait, why I don't need to go all the way over there. That's just to start the thing again. Um Oh, I seriously have to start it again, don't I? Well, that sucks. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna go back to all those colonies and, like, see if there's, like, a new info and such. And then I'll come back here and we'll share the info. Um, I'll probably continue mo mainly... I'll be honest, this part I was only gonna focus more so on side quests, but then it kind of became a mix between the two, which I don't mind that. But, yeah, I'm, I'll be honest, the next part and probably the part after that might be just some side quest heavy stuff, but that's fine. But anyway, guys, thank you all. So much for watching this video. Guys, if you like the video, please give the like button a hey, click and comment down below. Check about the video, down link about the video, and let me know, guys, what you think of, uh, I guess everything that we learned about the castle. Oh boy, the fact that we're going to be probably facing off against Ethel and, uh, whatever that guy's name is at some point. I have a feeling that guy's also going to be a hero for us, so, hmm, it's going to be very interesting. Oh! Ooh, ooh, that's very nice. Her idol animations, you know, trying a little, doing a little notebook uh diary keeping that's cool but yeah guys let me know how oh, you feel as always guys hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a beat and subscribe to the main channel too as in the description below as well as follow me on twitter both my main twitter rbg kim kids twitter are in there too thank you all so much for watching once again and i'll see you all next time